Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the world's famous repetition diner. Your meals will be prepared by the Beast Mode Chef. He is the Super Set King. I was uh, thinking that um, we've been doing pretty well with um, Behind the Apron. Yeah, I agree. Uh, we touched on a lot of topics. We touched on macronutrients, that was uh, good. fat loss, that was good, that was muscle good. gain. Yeah. Uh, we spoke on the effects of alcohol in your workout program. True. Um, so I, I kind of think that's going well, but I think that we should give back a little more. So you want to get more hands on or you want to stay behind the camera and give it out or like where, where, well, where I, you going I, with what you think? I still think that you know there's still a huge misconception about personal training and about what personal trainers are and what they should represent. Mm. Uh, when we first started out this thing because uh, we, we've been rocking a long time and we first started out the goal was to bring real personal training back True. and I think we've been successful at that Okay. But personal training isn't just taking somebody to a tough workout. You follow True. me? There are people True. with limitations, people with ailments, people with, with, with just don't know how to get started. There are so many, so many different levels, and it's so complex when it comes to personal training. Okay. So what I've been thinking is when someone goes to look for a personal trainer, I don't even think they know where to start. Ooh, or you follow good. me? That's I, good. I think yeah. you just go to the, the, the nearest fitness center and purchase personal training. What's that convenient? Absolutely. Right. And then I was thinking, when you go to the doctor, you're trusting that your doctor has the remedy or pretty much can treat your condition, or at least treat the symptoms. True. So if you go to the gym and get a personal trainer, how do you know that this personal trainer is even capable mm -hmm. of taking you to your goal? Okay, so you kind of want to get back out like we did when we went to Platinum. Nutrition. Yes, yes, yes. Actually get yes. hands on and show uh -huh. people exactly mm -hmm. what it is. Okay, okay. So I give like or take, that. man, I, I have been working give or take seven days a week for the last five years. Yeah, you yeah. have. That's a lot of time. That's, yeah. So, I recently, yes, yes. mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. so I recently said, you know what, I think I need to take some Sundays off so I can better serve the people throughout the week. Okay. You follow me? I so like I, can, I, can, I can write those workouts better. I, okay. can, I can give more energy, you know what I mean? More right. efficiently and effectively if I'm, if I'm rested. So sure. I think what I'm going to do is not work any more Sundays, but Ooh. I still want to give back. Okay. So what I'm thinking to do, man, is go ahead and take away all the people's misconceptions about personal training and about personal trainers. Okay. So what I would like to do is take maybe a four-hour window each Sunday Okay. Where I could just sit down and just talk to the community. Um, this is absolutely free of charge. I, I really want to feed the people that are hungry. All right. Now, when I say hungry, I mean the people that are hungry for change. Right. If they're sedentary, they're sitting on the couch, they want change, but they just don't know where to start, come over here and talk to the chef. All right. Okay. If, if, okay. if you're already training, and most people think they work out hard. Right. But you know the chef, take them beast mode. Oh, that's all we do over here. All right. So if they're already in great shape and they want to go to another level, Come over here and see the chef. Okay. So I think I'm going to block off 30 minute increments in a four hour window mm -hmm. each Sunday to really give back. So mm -hmm. people can actually come over here and sit down with the chef for 30 minutes, absolutely free. We can talk about your meal plan. We can talk about how to assess your, your lean mass and body fat. We can talk about how to put together your workout program. We can talk about what you're going to look for when you go look for a personal trainer. And it may not be here with the chef or at Body Axe, but I'm going to show you what your trainer should be able to tell you when you go to look for one. So you give it back. Oh, give, give it back, back everything. Give everything. Back. Okay, Absolutely. okay. So you feed them. You feed them more than just their body. You feed them mind again. Okay, so we're taking behind the apron and we actually doing the physical give We're back. going out and we're feeding the hungry. All you got to do like is, be, is, is be hungry for change. And we're okay. going to fix up a plate for you. Feed the hunger. You know, I've been saying okay. in, in pretty much a lot of our videos, I really dislike fitness salesmen. And this is people <laughs> that's making money off the industry, right. but not really here for the people. So we're going to feed the people. What do you think about that? Uh, this, yeah, that's the perfect idea. All right, let's do it. Let's, let's start it up this Sunday. Okay. Fair enough? Fair enough. Let's All get right. it done. Perfect.